Hi, I'm Vivian Tan and welcome to the Bosch Master Gourmet series. Today I'm going to share with you a recipe for a hearty mushroom soup with chicken dumplings and a hint of white truffle oil. It's a delicious filling soup with an Asian twist and is great for the soul. So let's get started. Let's start with preparing all the vegetables and everything we need for the soup first. And to do this, I am going to use my Bosch 800 watt Maxo Mix hand blender. I have 20 grams of carrots and celery. Put the lid on. And then you have your Maxo Mix hand blender. Simple as clicking it on. And here, beautifully consistently chopped carrots and celery. Now you're going to do this with all your vegetables. We have some garlic, onions, and mushrooms. So using the large chopper attachment, I'm doing minced chicken today for our dumplings, but if you wanted to, you can make your own burgers out of fish, pork, beef. Pop it on and use the turbo. Perfectly minced chicken. Okay, so let's cook the vegetables for the filling. Pan on medium heat. Add in two tablespoons of cooking oil. Let that heat through for a little while. Let's add the onions, 20 grams. And here is the celery and carrots that we chopped before. When the celery, the carrot, and the onion has softened a little bit, we can add in our garlic. This is going to make a delicious, hearty filling for our chicken dumplings. Scoop it up. We're going to set this aside. Up next, the mushroom soup. Have your soup pot here ready. So let's start with some unsalted butter. It makes the soup really rich and creamy. Add in my onions. If dreams would smell, this would be the smell of dreams. That's what I think. Now that our onions are softening, I'm gonna add in the mushrooms. These are the sliced mushrooms from before, using our chopper. We'll let the mushrooms and the onions soften together. Add in our chopped up garlic. What would cooking be like if there was no onion and no garlic? It just wouldn't be the same, would it? Time to add in the chicken stock. Amazing how a few simple ingredients like this can make a very rich and tasty aromatic soup. Mmm, that's beginning to smell really good. Let's add in our fresh milk. This is going to add a real creaminess to the mushroom soup. Okay. Delicious. Let's season with a little bit of salt and pepper. Just a pinch will do. Okay, while the soup is going to be simmering, it's time for us to make our dumplings. Let's take over our cooled vegetable mix. While the soup is boiling, I'm going to show you how easy it is to make our chicken dumplings. So here's the cooled vegetables that we had before. We add it to our minced chicken. Thoroughly mix that through so that every dumpling will have some of the ingredients. Take your gyoza skin. Take a small amount of dumpling mixture here. Trial and error. You'll find out how much you need after you make the first one or two. But approximately half a tablespoon should be good. I like to use a little bit of lightly beaten egg to seal the dumpling. Fold your dumplings into half. Start by sealing one end of the dumpling. Press it all the way up to the top. And there is your half moon gyoza. Now these are ready to go into our soup, so let's take them over. Okay, now we're going to cook our dumplings. Just pop the dumplings into the water to boil. It takes about four to five minutes. Okay, so while our dumplings are cooking, let's use the Bosch Maxo Mix Hand Blender. It comes with a high quality stainless steel foot which guides liquids directly onto the rotating blades. This is the innovative Four Wings Quattro Blade Pro. We're using the turbo button. It has a nice non-slip soft touch handle, which is ergonomically shaped for excellent handling. So we're ready to plate. Dumplings look absolutely gorgeous. Just 
slide them in like that. Add a little bit of cracked black pepper and just a little dash of truffle oil. Voila! Gourmet mushroom soup with chicken dumplings with a hint of white truffle oil. <laughs>